What's going on, everybody? Spunky Nice Nine One coming to you guys for another video. So the post NFL draft phase of free agency has officially begun. This is the uh, phase of free agency that following the course of the draft and stuff. Um, veteran players who remained on the uh, who remained free agents following the initial phase of free agency. You know, back in March, these are, these are veteran players who did not find a home at that time, but now. These you no know, teams with you no know, post NFL drafts. You know they start looking at veteran players to bring in and uh, sign. And officially, we are in that phase now because the Seattle Seahawks have signed uh, Ezekiel Ansah to a one-year contract, according to multiple sources, including NFL Networks um, Ian Rappaport. Ezekiel Ansah, according to rumors, was was a was a guy who the Eagles were definitely interested in. You know the Seahawks were, of course, one of those teams. That was rumored to be heavily pursuing him as well, but he, like I said, he has just he has just he has just agreed to a one-year contract with the Seahawks. For the Seahawks, this move makes a lot of sense because the Seahawks traded Frank Clark to the Kansas City Chiefs, you know, following the big contract that they gave Russell Wilson. So they, you know, they 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 need they were in need of a um, defensive end, you know, following like I said, following the trading of um, Frank Clark. So it makes a lot of sense why the Seahawks were sign this guy. Um, e Eagles, like I said, the Eagles were definitely rumored you know, to be interested in him. But the Seahawks definitely needed him more. And he would definitely get a whole lot more playing time in Seattle than he would have in Philadelphia. You know, the Eagles, of course, are always looking to add to their D-line. But our D-line is, is pretty darn good, man. A lot of pieces on our D-line. So for him, you know, you know, going to Seattle, you know, if it's, if it's all about playing time, yeah, Seattle was definitely a better fit, you know, was a better place for him to go than Philadelphia because he would have been a rotational piece and, you know, he would have been a rotational, you know, rotational piece in Philadelphia. But, yeah, um, Ezekiel Ansar signs a one-year contract. He's heading to Seattle. Um, look, look for other big-name players such as um, Adama Kasu, Michael Crabtree, Eric Berry, um, Dez Bryant, maybe, you know, guys like that. Look for those guys. Uh, Laguerre Blunt can't forget Laguerre Blunt. Um, Stephen Wisniewski is still out there as well. But look for those guys in the up in the upcoming weeks to um, also start finding homes. You know, um, Jay Ajayi is also still out there as well. So, you know, in the upcoming weeks, now that the NFL draft is you know behind us and teams are looking for veteran players that have, you know veteran free agent players. Look for those guys in, in the upcoming um, days to really start um, you know drawing interest from from teams. And uh, you know, getting picked up by teams. So yeah, Ezekiel Ansah was definitely a guy. Like I said, the Eagles were, you know, were definitely interested in. Um, in the video I made about him, I, I did slip up there, and you guys corrected me in the comment section that he was not, you no, know, he that he was a free agent. I definitely slipped up in that video. But you guys definitely let me. You guys remind me of that, and I appreciate that. Thank you guys for telling me about that. But yeah, you know, he, he you know, he was, um, you no know, a. Very good defensive defensive end for the Lions for many years. He had his share of injuries, but he was a very solid player overall. And it would have been it would have been cool to have him in Philadelphia, but I understand, you know, he, he probably wants more playing time and you know he would have been rotational in Philadelphia. So best of luck to you in Seattle. You know, no hard feelings. The best of luck to you in Seattle. Um hopefully the Eagles definitely do grab one or two players out of free agency that, that remain. Um, I would I would love to see Steven Wisniewski come back. We'll see, we'll see what, what happens there. Of course, I would love to see him bring him back. But Ezekiel Ansah, like I said, is officially off the board. He's he's headed to Seattle on a one year contract. Best of luck to him in Seattle. Um, if you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and tell me what you guys think. Once again, um, former Detroit Lions defensive end Ezekiel Ansah. Has agreed to terms with the Seattle Seahawks in a one-year contract. Um, the Eagles were definitely interested in him. You no, know, he was rumored to be on the Eagles' radar, but the Seattle Seahawks, you know, who des who desperately needed a um, defensive end after parting ways with Frank with Frank with Frank Clark, another another player with the Eagles were interested in Frank Clark. But after um, parting ways with Frank Clark, they um you know they they, they signed Ezekiel Ansah. So, like I said, best of luck to him in Seattle. But as always, go birds, man. If you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe button, hit the notif notification button, hit the like button, and tell me what you guys think. A couple more big name players out there. We'll see what happens. But you guys, you know, let me know what you think in the comment section. As always, go birds. Spunky Nights 91 is out of here. Fly like a fly. Peace.